Hi guys, welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm sharing with you how I've been styling some of my most basic capsule wardrobe pieces for this spring transitional season. So this is definitely more of a fun video just to give you some ideas and to help you refresh your creativity and re-inspire your personal style for this coming season. So in today's video, I'm gonna be styling a basic white tee and a white button-up blouse, hopefully pieces that everyone owns. So yeah, let's get into the outfits and I hope you enjoy. Okay, starting off here with a classic white t-shirt. One of the basic ways to wear a white t-shirt and dress it up is to tuck it into a pair of high-waisted light blue denim. I think it's such a classic laid back look that you just can't go wrong with. To make this more of a going out for drinks type of look, I love to put something flowy on top, a little more feminine, and then have some low rise kitten heels with a very simple crossbody. I think there's something really sexy and laid back about a sling back heel, so I love that. The next outfit is for a much more casual going out in the city type of look. I definitely like to do a little bit of street wear and make sure to pair it with very practical accessories. So I have these black chunky platform sandals from Doc Martens and I use the belt bag crossed over the top of my chest from Lululemon. And this to me is like ready to go all day. The next outfit is if it gets chilly outside and you're caught out doing errands. I love throwing a wool coat on top of a white tee and jeans. I think it's so classic, so chic. And then pairing it with some Chelsea boots. I just think is this perfect mix of masculine and feminine. And I love these boots actually, they're from Amazon. The next look I love when I really wanna be casual but have a little personality as well. And so I love the juxtaposition here of a really simple white tee with some flared black culottes and point to toe heeled booties and then a black cross body straight across the white tee like breaks up the color a bit and just makes it very decisive. And now because it's spring, it's probably raining or it's at least a little bit chilly. So throwing a classic beige trench coat over top, more like kind of a cape style, I think is so chic and really changes how the outfit feels. This next outfit gives me a lot of day date kind of vibes. And I think it's because of their very flowy jacket has a more feminine feel along with the kitten heels. And then the black culottes are a little bit more dressed up with oh, even with a white t-shirt. This next outfit is a total weekend off duty look. And that's just the standard white t-shirt and jeans, but throwing a little bit of color in here with a logo sweatshirt draped over your shoulders, um, tied around, and then just a pair of white casual vans. I think the blue sweatshirt does a little color blocking with the jeans, which looks really put together, but also really laid back. Okay, now let's switch it up. I really just felt like getting out of the pants, so I'm working with my white slip dress and pairing that with a white t-shirt. So I think it's a really cute, simple look to so pair a white t-shirt knotted on the top with a pair of white sneakers. I love this like girl next door, pretty casual look, and I love how the slip dress texture is a little bit different from the t-shirt and gives that a little bit of interest. Now if we wanna take this look outside, say to the park, to the zoo, I love throwing over top an oversized denim jacket. I love the different ways you can wear it and how much more casual this makes it feel. Moving on to a white button down. I love this linen oversized button down from Ritzia. One of my favorite ways to wear it is untucked with a pair of light wash denim. This is my very work from home, I'm on Zoom call look. Um, and then if I want to bring this into the city a bit more, I love to do a French tuck and then pairing that with some chunky black sandals and a belt bag. Now I'm gonna make this a little bit more put together. I love putting a structured coat or blazer on top. It has just such a chic laid back vibe that I love. To make this look a little more office appropriate, I think we could just switch out the sandals here for some kitten heels and then buttoning the blouse all the way to the top. Looks a lot more put together and structured. Now something about the spring just makes me feel like so many trench coat looks. This look I think is really cute for a little stroll in the park and I don't know why, it just reminds me of being on lunch break and walking through Central Park. Something I've been loving to do recently is find more ways to wear a bright logo sweatshirt and I've been loving to pair it with a white bun up underneath and some kitten heels and light blue taper jeans. I think it's such a chic look. To make this look even more put together, I love a structured overcoat, a sleek crossbody bag. This look to me is just everything. 
So completely opposite of this preppy look, I want something really, really relaxed and cool. So I love to play with the structure of her white button-up and pair it with very decidedly casual accessories like a pair of simple white sneakers, a baseball cap, and then my sports bag. An outfit I love from going from being at home to running outside is pairing a sports bra with a white button up on top and some black culottes. Pair that with some white sneakers, a baseball cap, and a crossbody. I can take on the whole world all day. For more accessory, I feel like this wool scarf wrapped around is such a cute option for if you're dealing with a little bit of chilly weather still. And actually I'm obsessed with how this looks. Now if we want to get a little bit more girly and feminine, let's say you're going on a date, I love adding a hair scarf, a silky hair scarf with some jewelry. It looks really, really cute and put together. And I like to balance all that with some relaxed accessories. So that's why I paired it with white sneakers and my belt bag. Okay, so I want to be legit. A lot of times I spend the day at home all day and this is a casual outfit that I would wear around the house or doing errands in our building. I love the look of a white button up with a big hair clip. There's something very like painterly or very like journalistic about it that I really, really love. And it always makes me feel good even if I'm just gonna be spending time at home. Jewelry is another one of those things that really elevates my mood and makes me feel like I'm more put together. So this next outfit I love, and I know this is like a love or hate it thing, but I love pairing denim on denim. I think it's such a laid back, casual look, and I just love it with some really staple black accessories. Um, to me, this is a good to go look. This next one is an outfit I literally wear all the time, and that's a white t-shirt with black culottes, white sneakers, and a denim jacket. Pair that with a crossbody, this is usually how I'll pick up my kid from school, how I'll run around to get errands. Um, it's a very easy and fuss-free look. This next one is my go-to like rainy day type of look, and I'm not really sure why, but I kind of tend to go to the library when it rains, so I associate a trench coat and a baseball cap with the library. So this to me is a very relaxed, comfortable, like working all day situation, and um, yeah, I really like it. Okay, so the next five outfits I wanted to dedicate more to office wear looks. I know different offices have very different environments, so I tried to cover maybe one of each type that I've worked at at least. So for the very business formal type of office, you have to wear a white blouse, black pants. So I love this look for a work environment like that. I think it's a nice take on those staple basics and still looks very chic and put together. The next I think is more if you can venture outside of the super business formal look. I love a very flowy trench with this and actually I think for my work office I could have worn boots but sometimes if you are in a more professional environment you have to wear heels and so I swap that with heels for outfit B. Again I think buttoning your blouse all the way to the top really makes a more professional statement. Okay, we're getting more casual as the outfits go on. Here is much more for a business casual environment, one where you can possibly wear a sweater, no jacket, and swap that with a pair of sandals. To make this a little bit more springtime chic instead of the sweater look, I like to pair this with a trench coat and add a little bit of neutral color to this otherwise black and white outfit. And then adding like a very sporty type of accessory like this, I think it's really cute and not something that really other people have to see unless you're on your way to lunch. This last outfit is something I would most likely wear to my own office because it's much more relaxed environment. So I still like the white button up and blouse idea, but pair it with a pair of white sneakers and a denim jacket and a little scarf to keep you warm. I think is a really cute on the go look. If I wanted to do the most, I would pair this with a pair of kitten heels instead and a black crossbody. It's a little bit more of city chic vibe, which is often appropriate for a midtown office. I love a scarf or a sweater in general because offices just tend to be cold, so I love that this wool scarf really doubles as something that's useful for me while I'm spending time outside of home. All right, so that's it. Those are my 30 outfits with two of my most basic capsule wardrobe pieces. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found a little bit of inspiration on different ways to wear these pieces for the changing season. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.